If you ever imagine a dustbin should open itself when you bring the dust in front of it, here is the project. In this, I will show you the Thinkercad output, physical dustbin output as well as the code explanation. Welcome to Thinkertank. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel. I have taken the cardboard sheet. This one I have got it from Amazon. Next material required is the ultrasonic sensor for distance measurement purpose. Next is Arduino Uno board along with USB cable for connecting it to computer. Next is jumper wires for connection, fevicol for making the dustbin, stick to attach it to servo motor, scissor for cutting the parts and plaster as well as the servo motor. Now I have cut into pieces in, a, in the shape of the dustbin. It is having the height of 15 cm with a width of 5 cm. Now I have made it as a dustbin shape along with the base attached to it. I have taken the servo motor and I am attaching it to the corner of the dustbin with the help of the double tape. The stick is attached to the tip of the servo meter as you can observe in the photo. Now I have taken the top cover of the dustbin in the bended form so it can be easily opened and closed. Now I am attaching the top cover with the help of the plaster to the dustbin. Now the ultrasonic sensor is attached in, the, in front of the dustbin so that it looks like a robot eye to the dustbin. Now the four jumper wires are taken and connected to the four pins of the servo motor like this. These wires are for VCC ground trig and echo pin of the ultrasonic sensor. Now Servo motor, ultrasonic sensor as well as Arduino Uno board is ready for the project to get started with. This is a circuit connection of the smart dustbin. Here you can clearly observe VCC of the ultrasonic sensor is going to get connected to 3.3 volts of the Arduino Uno board, trick pin to the 9th pin of the Arduino Uno board, echo pin to the 10th pin of the Arduino Uno board, ground pin to the ground pin of the Arduino Uno board. Now let's make this connection physically using the Arduino Uno board and ultrasonic sensor. Ground pin to the ground pin, trick to the ninth, echo to the tenth, power to 3.3 volts. Now let's see the connection between Arduino Uno board and servo motor. Servo motor's out wire is connected to 11th pin of the out Arduino Uno board. Servo motor's power wire is connected to 5 volts of the Arduino Uno board. Servo motor's ground wire is connected to ground pin of the Arduino Uno board. Now let's see how we can connect this in Arduino Uno board. Power to 5 volts, ground to ground, signal pin to 11th pin of Arduino Uno board. Now I am attaching the USB cable to laptop. Let's see the code. In the code, I have included the servo library which allows us to control the servo motor with its commands. Next, I am defining the trigger pin, echo pin of the ultrasonic sensor and servo pin of the servo motor. I am defining the maximum distance as 20 cm. You can alter this according to your wish. Next is, I am creating the servo object. And inside the void setup function, I am writing the serial begin in order to create serial communication for debugging purpose. I am setting the trigger pin as output and echo pin as output and I am attaching the servo pin to the servo motor. Next is the void loop function which is going to execute repeatedly. So inside the void loop function, I am sending the 10 millisecond pulse from the trigger pin and measuring the time duration it takes for the echo to bounce back. 
once the duration is calculated we get the distance distance we get it using the time per distance that is 29.1 so if this distance is less than the maximum distance that is 20 centimeters servo will turn 90 degree that is the dustbin will open otherwise the dustbin will be in closed condition the same thing will be displayed using the serial print and command in terms of distance in centimeters the de delay of 1 second is written in order to start with the next loop this is it now we are going to compile it by clicking the right mark once the compilation done we are clicking the right arrow mark in order to upload the code to the Arduino Uno board After this, if you bring the dust in front of the dustbin within 20 centimeters, the dustbin will open it up and it will close by its own. Now we'll see how it, it works in Thinkercad. I'm clicking on create and I'm typing Arduino Uno and I'm typing the ultrasonic sensor and I am selecting the 4 pin ultrasonic sensor now I am typing servo and I will get the servo now I will make the connection as ground pin of Arduino to ground pin of ultrasonic I am changing the color then and there itself now connecting the 3.3 volts from the Arduino Uno to VCC of ultrasonic sensor, 9th pin of Arduino Uno to trick pin of ultrasonic sensor, 10th pin of Arduino Uno to echo pin of ultrasonic sensor. Connection between the ultrasonic sensor and Arduino Uno is over now. Coming to the servo motor, I am connecting the ground pin of the servo motor to the ground of Arduino Uno. Power pin of servo to 5 volts of Arduino Uno. Signal means output of servo motor to 13th pin of Arduino Uno. I am changing the color. Now I am copying the, all the codes and pasting it in text form of Tinkercad once the cop code is copied I am clicking on start simulation you can clearly observe how the servo motor is turning 90 degree so this is it physically the output is this one please subscribe to this channel if you like this video thank you